Neutrinos are extremely special. They are the lightest particles with mass, they have no electric charge and only interact weakly with matter. They come in three flavors, which we call electron, muon and tau neutrino, and the observed oscillations between these flavors is what tell us that neutrinos have mass. However, we don't know how small this mass is, and it's the ultimate goal of the Katrin experiment to measure this mass. The standard model of particle physics tells us that neutrinos should be massless. However, we know that this picture is incomplete. The fact that neutrinos have mass is the world's first hint of physics beyond the standard model. For every atom in the universe, there are more than one billion neutrinos. And even though they have a tiny mass, they play an important role in the evolution of the universe. Katrin stands for Karlsruhe Tritium Neutrino Experiment. Our experiment is based in Germany at the Tritium Laboratory of the Karlsruhe Institute of Technology. We are an international collaboration of about 150 scientists and engineers from institutes in seven countries. The way we measure the neutrino mass in Katrin is based on the beta decay of tritium, where both neutrinos and electrons are produced. We are looking for a small deformation of the electron spectrum that is caused by the mass of the neutrino. For this, we are operating a high-activity tritium source with up to 100 billion decays per second and investigate the energy of the electrons with a high-resolution spectrometer system. Even though our new result is still compatible with a mass of zero, we have improved our previous limit by nearly a factor of two. Now we know that neutrinos are at least one million times lighter than electrons and more than a billion times lighter than a hydrogen atom. This result is based on more than 30 million electrons that we collected in more than 250 days of measurement, which is about a quarter of the final data set that we envision. Today, Katrin is the world's most sensitive model-independent experiment for the neutrino mass.